The Biden administration announced Wednesday it's canceling $6.1 billion in student loan debt for 317,000 people. The debt forgiveness targets people who attended the now defunct for-profit art institutes. In a statement, President Biden said the art institutes falsified data, knowingly misled students and cheated borrowers into taking on mountains of debt without leading to promising career prospects at the end of their studies. Education Secretary Miguel Cardona said for more than a decade, hundreds of thousands of hopeful students borrowed billions to attend the art institutes and got little but lies in return. The Education Department said the art institutes lied to students by falsifying the average salaries of graduates. The art institute's parent company, the Education Management Corporation, sold its schools in October 2017 and filed for bankruptcy in 2018. The remaining art institute's colleges stayed open under new management until September 2023. Two years ago, the U.S. Supreme Court rejected Biden's first attempt to cancel $400 billion in student debt for 43 million Americans through executive action. Since that time, his administration has attempted to forgive student loans using a more targeted approach in an attempt to circumvent legal challenges. In this case, the Biden administration is using the Borrower Defense Loan Discharge Program, making borrowers eligible for relief if they've been defrauded by their university. In order to qualify for forgiveness, borrowers must have been enrolled at any art institute school between January 1, 2004 and October 16, 2017. Eligible borrowers won't have to take any action. The debt will be forgiven automatically. About 43 million borrowers owe $1.7 trillion in student loan debt, according to the Education Data Initiative. I'm Lauren Taylor, Straight Arrow News.